What's going on, everybody? Welcome to episode 7 and the final episode here of our Copa Libertadores Challenge with Palmeiras. And today, we are in the final. Palmeiras, River Plate, the final. River Plate, of course, a very good team. Um, got to the final in the real life one recently, or the most recent one. They lost 3-1 to Flamengo, but still a very, very good team, of course, getting to the final. And today, we have them here in a in a final as well. Um this is tough. We've had a very tough run in. Flamengo in our round of 16, Boca in our round of 8, Atletico in our round of t uh, 4, and in the final, of course, we have River Plate. It's going to be very, very difficult. We're going to jump right on into it. For those who don't know, we do do these finals live, or most of our finals live. So you're going to have to be stuck with me for the entire duration of the of the game but hopefully you guys enjoy it and hopefully we play rather well and grab ourselves the win river plate um as we've said multiple times very very good and hopefully we are up for it we've had a variety of different challenges we had a high scoring um type of tie with flamengo we had a very tough second leg with boca we had a very low scoring tie with atletico we've had a variety of different um ties over the couple of rounds we've had to get through and now we have a one-off we've been playing well in our first ties or our first legs of games hopefully this will continue that way even though there is only one leg this time and hopefully we'll grab a win as Fijual runs forward into traffic and couldn't find a pass but it's going to be very very tough a very good team here from Argentina and River Plate Palmeiras a very good Brazilian team as well um, for those who don't know, we've taken them one step further. I believe they got at least to the quarterfinal, maybe the semifinal if I remember. But they also finished second in Brazil. So this team is no joke as we look for a pass out of here. Actually, we'll just run it out. And we do <laughs> manage to get that out. Oh, and then we give it away in a really poor spot. Um, but let's jump into the game. We're ready for the game. And hopefully we can contain this very good attacking side and River Plate as that gets headed up into the air and not so good spot and, and he gets headed down just wide of the post into the side netting early warning shot our way we cannot be making silly mistakes as Fredatino wins that header if that's the center back there the small guy we are going to have a little bit of joy with Fredatino in the air today especially on those kickoffs as that gets clipped forward Prato the second leading goal scorer in this tournament so far as that header comes in and once again that guy at the far post there getting a header and that's not what we want to see and so I've been all river plate so far not what we want it's Casco coming forward Vidual does well to force him off and it's a good turn inside and slide to Freitasa can we get this through to Cadete can Cadete get away didn't get to it it was managed very well by the right back and held off Zuccolini coming forward, but once again, a good tackle. And now we have men forward, and Cadete's in a really good spot. Can that ball get there? Not quite. I thought we had that. I thought that break was on. We've taken it away once again. And now we're on it here, and the overlap is being made, and Freitasa's in here. Cuts back in, and Freitasa forces a did save. And Oh, I thought Fredatino was going to have the shot there. Not quite. Can he clip it back across? We cannot dealt with but now opportunities are starting to show up for us 20 minutes in or so as oof, he stepped in it is a foul we're gonna have a free kick in a decent spot here let's see if we can go for goal let's see if we can get this on target and we do or we'll put it straight into the wall not what we want to see it's like it's played out wide casco panola feel if we can get some headers from Fredatino there. We might have some joy. As that ball gets clipped in here. Oh, come on. Taking forever to get a touch on that. River Plate moving the ball around now. It's Prato. Dealt with very nicely. As we race forward, it's Mestris. Cuts back inside. Oh, God. I thought we could slip that ball into space for Fredatino to run onto. Not quite. They give the ball right to us here in a really good spot. And Mestris is in a good spot as well. 
And Mestris, that touch took way too long. I thought he gave it away, but he's still holding on to it. Can slip it back. And it's come to the top of the box and it's fired wide there. I kind of wanted that to go to Pedrenda. He was a little bit closer to the penalty spot. Went to the top of the box. Couldn't find ourselves. A shot on target, though. And we're starting to, as we said, create a little bit more. And River Plate have slowed down just a touch. But they are very much playing with a little bit of pace and trying to really hit quickly on the break. And at the moment, we're dealing with it. But if, you know, one slip, and that could be a completely different issue as Cadete is coming forward here and it's cleared away. Very even start, really, in this final. As he turns, tries to get a cross in, and it's blocked away. Another heavy touch. Forces a bad ball. That ball managed to get through. I'm not sure how. Fredatino on it. Laranjo. It's been really good for us. As that turns and finds Mestres, he's going to go for goal. Straight at Armani in net. Not too bad of a hit, but needed to be more toward the corner. A bit easy for the goalkeeper. Can we win that off him? Not quite. Trying to force mistakes back here. So that gets clipped forward and out of play. And that's what we want. Just the press. Force a couple of mistakes here and there in their half. So that gets clipped. No, I wanted to go up the side. Up the wing for that clip ball. That's decent football here. And now they've got men forward. And this is where it gets dangerous for, for us as we chase. Do well to get a touch on it there. Can't quite end the attack. And he gets toward the byline up this wing. And we do manage to nick it off him, though. Can we race away? Is Costinho racing forward? Fernandez is chasing. Is he going to get there? Costinho doing well, using his body to hold off. And Costinho clips it forward. Fredatinho! Oh, I probably could have taken that down. He went for the acrobatic effort. And it's blocked away. It's a good break. Very well done by Costinho at left back. Couldn't do enough for it. Oh, we got to hold on to that there. I tried to slide a pass back to the goalkeeper. And River Plate are coming forward now. It's a good tackle. Can this slip back into space anyway? Thought we held on to it and the header comes in and it's straight at the goalkeeper. And we are going to head into halftime nil-nil. This tie very much on edge. And this is anybody's final, which is kind of nerve-wracking on our side. They're holding on to the ball a little bit better, but we're getting the chances. But the way they play, the way they break with pace, it's dangerous. You have to time everything properly or they are going to get opportunities and that is not what we want in this second half as that gets out wide does well to take that down cuts back inside nicely can't quite win it off him there we force a mistake as that gets put out wide moving the ball around relatively well we get a foot on that but he's held on to it and we've taken that one away though Here's Mestris. One back inside. Nicely done. Can we get it out wide? We can. I thought that ball through the middle might have been on, but didn't happen. That goes out of play. Break no longer on, but we still have the ball. Pedrenda can turn. Get it out wide. Nicely done. Fredatino can't quite hold on to it, but a little bit of luck, and it comes Pedrenda's way. And Pedrenda's going to go for goal, and he's finished it, and we lead in the final. Oh, a big slice of luck comes our way. And it just falls behind the defense. And Pedrenda picks it up. And he's been missing missing opportunities lately. But in the final, when it mattered, our best player smacks it home. It's a, a lot of luck, really. But this is a good cutback inside and a really good finish. He's just hit that with a little bit of venom. After the cutback, I oh, thought for a moment he might get a touch onto it, the defender. Goalkeeper can't get to it. And it's 1-0 here on 53 minutes, and we have the lead we very much craved. Now River Plate might have to open up just a little bit more. And when they bring men forward, they're going to have to do it in bigger chunks, and hopefully we can counter on that. But we will have to see as we move forward. But a huge goal, obviously, in this final. First goal is always huge. Fredatino out wide here. Freitasa coming forward with it. And Freitas is just running through the middle. I oh, thought we could hold off for a second and slide Fredatinho in. Didn't happen. River Plate trying to move forward with a bit of speed. Rather direct. 
But it's not happening as that ball gets played out nicely. And here's Mestris. And Mestris, can he slide this back? Clips it across. Can we get it one more across? And wow, what a tackle. I thought he was going to get a free shot at an empty net pretty much there. And that is one heck of a tackle. We slip it through. We can. And Pedrenda's on it. Slips it across. And blocked away. I was going to try and slip that to the top of the box. But there weren't really any open opening. Or there weren't any openings at the top. Open players either way. We couldn't get it done. So that gets played across. Nicely dealt with. Cadete. He slipped this through. He can. That's a lovely ball to Fredatinho. He's done so well. Slips it across. Oh, what a save. It's come back to Fredatinho. It's 2. It's 2-0. Two That's brilliant play, really. The, <laughs> the original save was really well done. And it's good football. It falls back and he just fires it into an empty net. And now we have one hand on the trophy. River Plate struggling to deal with this move. Very nicely done. It gets to the byline. Forces a good save here. It just gets a little bit lucky. It falls back to him. And that's a really good finish. Had to get it around the defender here. Does. Padrenda has to back up out of the way. No chance the goalkeeper is getting to that. A lovely finish. It's 2-0 on 67 minutes. A long way back now for River Plate, who have been causing us problems throughout the day, but at the moment, as they really push for this goal, get more direct, they're going to leave themselves a little bit more open. And at the back there, it doesn't help when they can't defend the regular play. It's 2-0. And here they come again. We're going to have to make some subs in a moment. Hopefully we can just keep them away here. As that gets clipped in, chested down, and away. So let's make some subs here. Padrenda, he's not coming off. He's been too good for us. We can get Freitasa off. Rios can come on. Just a little bit more pace. Fresh legs. And I think that's what we'll do. We have two Chisanos at left back. Pretty wild stuff. But yeah, I think we're just going to do those two substitutions for now. Padrenda may come off if he gets a like exhausted. But I think he'll be okay for the rest of the game. And Freitasa... Knows he's coming off the pitch. He's going to do all this himself as he races forward. Freitasa. And Freitasa slips it back. And Padrenda's here. Padrenda is 3-0. And that should be that. That should be game over. Padrenda again being clinical when he needs to be. 3-0 on the day. And we're taking our regular first leg performances and putting them into the final here. It's lovely stuff. Freitasa just kept running. He finds a good ball back. I thought we held on to it too long there, but that's a good finish. It really is a good finish here. Go back the opposite way. Had to, really. And he slides it into the back of the net. Freitas' last contribution is a brilliant assist. He's had a really good tournament for us. And he surely helped seal the final up. 3-0. River Plate chasing essentially shadows for the second half they've been very much off the pace especially since we scored our goal and their styles had to change just a little bit it's caused them problems their first half the style was working really well i figured they were getting chances and forcing themselves into good positions as he goes for goal there and forces a really good save out of the goalkeeper but the second half we've been much much better and after our goal they've had to open up even more and it's it's caused them problems as they force another good save here on the corner. There's ten minutes to go. They gotta they gotta get one now, you feel. As that gets headed down, and it's still held on to, and they're moving the ball around pretty nicely at the top, and it goes for goal and he forces another good save. And now River Plate, the pressure is coming. Forced in three really good saves out of our goalkeeper there. As that gets chest down, and Padrenda is racing forward here. Can we break on their corner? Done that before. One more. Nicely done. Can we slip it through? We can. Padrenda. Can he get away? Oh, that's a really good tackle. <laughs> it needed to be. He was through otherwise. A really good tackle. But on our way to the trophy. Copa Libertadores champions. Palmeiras. Who in real life, you never know. They are, they are not a bad team. They are a proper good team is what they are actually. As we get forward here, can we slip that through to Rios? We can. Nicely played. And Rios is fresh. 
trying to get away from Diaz here. Ooh, Diaz with a really good tackle. It's going to stay over here, though, which means this game is essentially over as we hold on. To, as soon as we say that, <laughs> we hold on to it, but we give it away. It's not going to change anything. They need three and at a time here. They would like a consolation, I imagine, at least. They would, though, 3 1, two years running, theoretically, would. That would suck. But 3 0 is probably even worse, I guess. So he cuts back inside, goes for goal. It's blocked. Quintero on it still, dealt with, and there it is. The final whistle. Palmeiras, Copa Libertadores champions. Two goals from Pedrenda, one from Fredatinho. Fredatinho, a player at the beginning when we started playing, you know, we kind of kept chugging along with because we figured, you know, this type of player may not fit to the type of style I wanted to play. But as the tournament went on, he got better and better, grabbed himself a goal in the final. Pedrenda, our best player, who'd been missing opportunities, still grabs himself two goals here. Very clinical today from Pedrenda. And it will show Vidual set to lift the trophy. It's a neat little trophy, not too bad. It's rather large, too. It is it is pretty big. One of the bigger trophies in terms of, I guess, height. Or seemingly height. It's definitely different. But here he goes. Set to lift, and there he goes. The confetti goes off. Champions of South America, Brazilians, Palmeiras, very, very much deserved. Our route to the final, and the team we played in the final, our route to this trophy, incredibly difficult. Flamengo, River Plate, Boca, um, Atletico as well. Powerhouses from Brazil and Argentina. And we knocked them out as we went along. Kept on rolling, kept on trucking. They were difficult. Many a variety of different ties. High scoring um, on the back foot in the second tie there against Boca in the second leg. Um, low scoring against Atletico. A different kind of counter-attacking team here in River Plate. Or they at least played that way today. A very, very difficult tournament. But we persevered, we got through, and now they are champions. Palmeiras, Copa Libertadores champions, and we complete our challenge. Very nicely done. Score may be a bit tough on River Plate, but deserved on our end, which is obviously where we want to be. We'll take a look at the top goal scorers and assisters before we sign off. Tevez and Prato, both on nine. Oh, Padrenda also finished with nine, with two in the final, which is good. Vidigal with eight for Gremio. Do we have anybody else on here? Fredatinho had six, which is good. Um, Freitosa had four. He had a good tournament. Um, assists. Mestres had seven. Padrenda had four. Very nicely done, Freitosa. Oh, look at that. We had three there. Freitosa, Cadete, and Fredatinho all with three. Very, very nicely done. Mantella with four clean sheets. Yellow cards, red cards, and that is it, guys. Next time round, we are going to be doing Flamengo. I originally planned to do Flamengo to start, but my jersey didn't arrive yet, and it finally has arrived. So we will be doing Flamengo next time round. And then from then on out, we'll try some of the other big teams, of course, as we go forward. We'll see as we get into it now. But for now, that is it. I hope you folks have enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more. In peace.